The fastest thing that you guys can implement in your life right now to change your life is gonna be who you are and who you bring to the table. Because once you start to change, this is for you, men, or any leader of the household. Listen, once you start to change, once you start to wake up earlier, once you start to have a better routine, once you start to get your body in shape, once you start to take care of yourself, once you start to have a little pride in yourself, it's contagious. <laughs> At 19 years old, I was shaking hands with Senator McCain, who was running for president at the time. We were shaking hands in a soccer field in Iraq. I had a belt-fed machine gun on my lap. At 19 years old, I realized, when I look back upon those photos, the type of responsibility that I had at that age. And ultimately, the type of responsibility that I had in the military has shaped me into who I am today. Because I had those experiences at a young age, I realized that when I came back, I couldn't get myself a girlfriend. And her daddy paid all of our bills and she had no understanding of money, no understanding of value of life, and has never left her little small bubble. I'm fortunate to have met my wife. For all of you watching this, when you seek out a partner and when you grow and challenge yourself, just remember experiences shape you in a good way and a bad way. So the more experiences that you have can shape you. And if you let them build you, they'll build you in a positive direction. Take the things that you've experienced and learn from them. If they're bad, learn not to do them again or learn to avoid those people. If they're good, go all in on that and bank on more. But just remember these little experiences add up and they ultimately create who you are experiences are who we are. Hey, what's up guys? Austin Hancock here. I get a lot of messages asking for some help in some capacity, whether it's financial, fitness, mindset, something to make your life better, something to make it to where you can go from this point right here, where you are now, to the dream life that you've always wanted to be living. Shoot me a text or give me a call. 405-697-4072. The number's right here. 405-697-4072. Call or text the number and let's change your life. The fastest thing that you guys can implement in your life right now to change your life is gonna be who you are and who you bring to the table. Because once you start to change, this is for you, men, or any leader of the household. Listen, once you start to change, once you start to wake up earlier, once you start to have a better routine, once you start to get your body in shape, once you start to take care of yourself, once you start to have a little pride in yourself, it's contagious. I think what you underestimate is how contagious it is with that pessimistic, piss poor attitude of poor woe me, I'm the victim. So many times I see people roaming this earth that are walking fucking zombies and they're blaming every Everybody else for their problems. Now, if everybody else is in charge of the problems that you have, then where does the responsibility lie? It relies on other people. And so I can't help it. You can't change anything if everybody else is responsible for where you are. So what? You had a fucking bad growing up or somebody did something to you or somebody stole from you or you'd have been given a fucking shitty hand deck of cards. So what? Get over it. I've served next to people in the Marine Corps that have had a shitty hand of cards and have made fucking phenomenal lives. I've worked next to people that have a shitty hand of cards and they fucking waller in it and go nowhere. It's ultimately what you do with the hand that you're dealt at the beginning of life. But you have to stop placating and being the victim. And you have to take control of it. If you're giving the power to everyone else, then that means you can't control your problems. Who's in control here? Go back to your wife and ask her if she's in control if you can't control it. Every time you fucking whine about things that are happening to you, whether they're financial, whether they're, oh, they've treated me this way. Oh, the DMV didn't let me do this. Somebody took my parking spot. Oh, somebody cut me off. All of these things that you let affect you because you're a little baby and you can't control yourself and you can't take responsibility. I see dumb fucks all the time when I'm taking my kids to school that are racing to work because they're a grown ass adult that can't wake up in time to go to their office to check in and have plenty of time to get their work done. If that's you, that's where it starts. It starts with you. It starts with you. You ultimately can shape the future of your family, your finances, and your fitness with the simple step of taking responsibility. And in a world where nobody fucking wants to take responsibility of anything, it points the finger for everything. The economy, the presidential election, my neighbor, all these things. Once you start to take responsibility, that's when you can start to actually mold your future like clay. Take it to the moon, baby. Take responsibility.